running that way, that would be great. Get them sent off because they're knackered. Get them in there. These raiders aren't doing what I kind of hope they would. Never mind, we can get more elite French in. We have to try our best to get them in as best we can. You need to go home. You can go in that trench if you can get there. This video is sponsored by Instant Gaming. Be sure to click on the link in the description to get this game for cheaper. Great War the Western Front is currently available at £21.30 at the time of this recording. Brilliant game and is much cheaper than buying it from there. Make sure you get it. You can have the Victory Edition as well, which is also cheaper than there. The link is in the description, be sure to press it before jumping on the website. You will be given a Steam key card if you are using Steam, which you can activate really easily. Be sure to check it out, and as always, thank you. Hello everybody and welcome back to another Moist Tea Gaming video where we're playing Great Wall of the Western Front again. The line looks a little precarious, the enemy are trying to push through Rathel and Bouncers. We've had to move units to hopefully stop them from doing that. Verdun is looking a little precarious, but I'm also trying to bait the enemy into attacking me there. Simply because I want to see if we have the forts on our side. We've just attacked uh, Hagenu with our multinational stack of doom, which has come down. With the plan being to have the French forces go down one column and the British forces go down another column or something like that. This will encircle this area here, trapping these units in and having them to be forced to stay there for at least a couple of turns, giving us an advantage. Just need to wait now and see if the enemy decide to attack, which they probably will. They've got a lot of units stacked around Saarburg, so it's a little precarious at best. None of them can move. We There are some dodgy areas. Luenville could be attacked they've got six next to our three and they've got a two next to it which won't be really a problem but they could break through potentially through colmar and then we have this over here verdun like i said i'm just trying to bait them into it up here is it looking too bad wipers though could be attacked on multiple fronts the al uh, enemy has done this a few times and if any of this is attacked by both of these that's going to be a hell of a fight just have to make sure we hold at least one of them off and we'll be able to keep the region so let's end the turn and see what happens grit your teeth enemy spy Ooh, they don't attack interesting Spies everywhere, yeah, so they're spying on us here, which isn't great, but it's okay. They've moved their units in and around, so we're going to have to readjust for that as well. Unread events, amphibious assault, Gallipoli has just happened, and that was a mess. National will, minus 10. And we have Coiled Danger. The game would like, well, our superiors would like to have barbed wire. Hmm. This is the tech tree. Kind of wanting a bit more money, but we'll be okay for now. Kind of wanting to want to go down the plains section. So we have something now, but we are going to want... Even the supplies, the supplies would be good to have. 
wherever it's gone. This one here, supply shack. But we need a rolling barrage. No, I need to stick with the plan. Get a rolling barrage sorted so that we can actually assault easier. So I'm not going to be sitting on the defense all the time. That is not my play. That would be a very good one, actually. Getting the rifle damage up. That would increase our defensive position a lot. We'll have to do that. We got the planes one because the game, uh, the, the uh, command was going to give us four squadrons of fighters. We're going to have to save them up. We need rolling barrage. I prefer the rolling barrage over the smoke, I think, just because I think smoke is a little bit precarious at times. Oh, we'll go for the rolling barrage. We're going to have to save up for it, though, which can be an issue. I mean, getting some more troops in would be good. That's not going to affect us too badly long term. We need that rolling barrage. We need the ability to do that. And the enemy have done some wriggling. They've got four now in Lil. So we could scrape. Four there as well. See, they've got if they've got four there, my minimum is to have half that amount there. So we're just gonna have to have But they can attack me from three different directions on this one. So that's more precarious. We'll keep hold of these. Keep them where they are. This is all looking a little bit precarious. I've got three there now. But they've moved their units from down there. Over to more this area. They've stuffed more units in Colmar, for example. So we're going to have to defend this area quite drastically. They've even reduced the amount of troops they have around Verdun. So these troops, we're gonna. So they've got eight in Colmar. We've got three in Epinel, and Nancy. We're gonna need to. And Funel, we need to definitely bolster. This is our stack of doom. We're gonna go for a, another attack on them if we can. So what do they have there? They've got two. So we've got three. We can play with here. So if we can have. Five in Lurinville, that would be good. I'm comfortable to have three here. We need another one in Epinal. I'm comfortable leaving only one there as well. Nancy, we're going to need one in Nancy as well. We've got two we can steal away from St. Meanhold as well, so that's good actually. They've got nine there. We're not going to be able to hold it with three, I don't think. Stick another one there. Four, at least. They're not going to break through with two. They can only attack me here once, so that's four. It's if this gets cut off, then all of these troops are then surrounded. We can't. We, we cannot have that. But I'll have another one in Lurinville. If they're going to attack anywhere to absolutely do me in, it's going to have to be there. I'll keep that strong. We'll have six. I should be able to easily hold them off then. If they attack Nancy, I should be able to hold off at least one of their attacks, which is good enough until we've taken that. And same down at Colomar. They can only attack me once, so I have time. Time is key. We've neither got a supply depot everywhere. There's just a couple of places. Oh, did we finish it? They all look good. Yeah, we have supply depots everywhere. That is fantastic. Right, so now we attack again. We do have the Air Force with us. They used their... The only use that they have at the moment from the enemy's perspective is they've gone for a balloon-busting mission. Which is that one. So they've gone up there. Well, we have the logistics and board time bonds and the improved helmet so they've gone right up there which is one two three four so one two three four so all right that, that must be all that they have currently probably going to get some other tech at some point well we want the rolling barrage 
So we'll see how this plays out. I could spread these out slightly. We do not get additional supply by having them here. And it will just protect our balloons and such. So in key areas like Lurinville, I'll have one there just in case. I'm not going to bother with Epinal or Nancy. I'll just have one in Lurinville. I don't think we'll put a balloon down there anyway, but we'll just have one there. It might deter them. And we're going to go for Haginu again. This reckons it will be a stalemate. Let's get in there. Ah, oh, didn't know this. Germany built an airport in Hagenu to train pilots during World War One. After the war, the area was part of an independent Republic of Alès Lorraine before returning to France in 1919. I didn't know it actually turned into a independent state for a while. Got a massive mix of units here. We've got, currently got a total of 17 cores here. This is the trench work that we did in the last battle. Quite significant. Could do with some barbed wire. That would be quite nice. And improved trenches, for example, that would also be nice. But we want the rolling barrage first of all for sure we never used it in the previous campaign but when attacking this lot it is certainly going to be beneficial i'll just update these trenches a bit i'm gonna go what i did last time but it looks a little bit neater now we've got the four artilleries facing right and the four artilleries facing north all of which can hit the command center area and these four can hit Y and the other four can hit X. So we have some artillery everywhere, but it won't be as concentrated as I would like. Now we're going to have to use the forest again like what we did. However, it will become more complicated because the enemy will have updated their trench work, which most certainly will negate the fact that there is a forest there. And this was just a mess. So we're going to have to do something about it. I'm going to use the elite British again to reporting hold to the line reinforcements reporting. and to defend reinforcements ready. We trenches. Have orders. Looks like we're late to the party. Gonna have twelve for duty. or murdering we the enemy with. Orders. Have one On the just sat down there. We're gonna be launching our attack from this location, so I might even actually stand by for orders. Just have another one Take here, for example. Positions. Now we'll have 12 for the assault. Could stick that down. We could have a reserve down. No, we'll have it down here just in case the enemy get giddy. We're going to have to have a few machine guns in place because the enemy may well attack. Probably from this direction. But if it's not going to be from there, it may be from this direction. Or it could be all this forward section here is at dire straits of being attacked. It really is. We can have that machine gun facing on that way. I know I'm going a bit machine gun mad, but when you don't have units here, it is beneficial. But up there, for example, we can have two sat there. That will help suppress the enemy there down here we could just have a couple in case the enemy get giddy now everyone else is going to be using our supply so we can use the frenchman again so we'll go for a same plan because it was a very sound strategy whether the enemy will adapt oh, to it is another oh, question oh, oh, oh. now we get a lot of these guys on in on les ordres where are the raiders? We'll go for the raiders as well. Where there's some more elite French in. The elite French are very good because they are very cheap. They're fighting on their home soil. Ish. So they're quite happy to run in there for cheap. And that's best as we're going to get it. So we'll begin the battle. Get our balloon up straight away. We do have the airplanes here to cover it this time. 
probably will send them in. I'm just going to to take out their pilots. Have one there. They have artillery over here this time, which is light artillery. They have more artillery there. We could do the same trick that we did last time. They don't appear to have updated them that much. Is it interesting? So uh, this means we're going to start just bombarding them straight away. We're going to have to get these in some kind of left and right, just so I know. We're going to continuously keep hitting this. It needs to be done. We're going to hit some of these MG. Now we'll go for the people. Do we go for the people or do we go for the MGs? That's facing this way. So if we attack from that forest, we should be safe. That is also doing the same. So is that. So is that. That one, however, could probably start aiming this way. Problem is, if I come over here and I want to take some of these, they are going to be a nuisance for sure. So we've got these two minimum that we want to take out. But we also want to be start bombarding all of these troops. Start reducing their numbers in general. At least weakening them. So we can get on with that. We've only got two heavies there. Got lots over here. So we're going to have to have one of our brave British troops to run over here and start murdering everything there. I might even stick a couple in that area. Oh, you know what might be good? If we take Y... They won't be able to reinforce from it. Keep some troops there. Then skip the command trench. And then take X. And then we can go for the command trench. Is that, is that doable? We could attack from the side. Anybody that we can have people in the forest murdering anybody over here. We could have people in here murdering anybody that isn't in the trench. That might not be a bad idea. Let me know what you think about this current plan in the comments. We could just have a dabble and see how we get on. We are going to be coming from this direction. So anybody in there I want dead. These can't shoot anybody around there, I don't think. So we can hit these and these, weaken them significantly. And then when we do want to cross, they'll have less things firing at them, and hopefully we can then suppress this section and this section while we run in. And then we should be safe from fire, hopefully. We also need to send one of our chaps right up here into that forest to take that out. So let's go. The artillery will be on the way. Just like that. We're going to start sending our troops north. They do have a balloon, so they are going to see us. A little bit annoying, but it is what it is. All of them move over. That will be fantastic. They're all now going for it. Our guns are reloading. Hoping the enemy shoot these guys. We're moving. That will be ideal. The planes are just floating around. The enemy don't seem too keen to want to try and take out our balloon, which suits me. Set this up. We're just going to pause it slightly. Now they've just decided to send in a, a barrage or keep these guys moving forward. Get them in there. Move these over. Put it on slow mo. No, I didn't. I didn't press the wrong button. Oh, I did. I sent them home instead. That is infuriating. Suppress that. And hopefully this. I need you guys up here now. I sent six units home accidentally. More elite. French, please. Need to start hurting some of this. They will be the next to reinforce the area. Good 
could get these troops over to start murdering them. That machine gun isn't going to get taken care of too quickly. These can run in there. If we can get these troops running that way, that would be great. Get them sent home because they're knackered. Get them in there. These raiders aren't doing what I kind of hope they would. Never mind, we can get more elite French in. Get them all on skirmish mode and sent forward. Pause the game just for a second while we get these bombardments ready. Get more blowing up. They are taking care of that artillery, which is nice. Continue the game. Once we attack again, we could suppress it again. They are going to get taken out. Attention! Go that way quick. Now you go forward. That MG is now down. You just need to hurry up, lads. What are you doing? Let two of these in there dead quick. And more in there. We can start bombarding this area. Weaken this. That ain't great. They are also shooting me now as well. Either they need to go home, but they're not going to get there in time. You need to be brought forwards. You still need to be wary of their artillery. Hopefully they won't shoot the wrong men. In theory. Keep pushing all of this forward. You go up there as well. You move around also we can get these troops in we can start bombarding some more of this we're gonna have to get rid of some of these mg nest i wonder if we can eliminate them all with artillery we've grabbed this point now we need to take care of these units still though we have eyes around there, so no one's going to come from that area. We can get more elite French in. On arrive après la bataille. Right there. That MG is still active. That needs to get gone. We need to keep pushing and moving forward. These units are looking very dangerous. Get rid of some of that while we can. That MG is not eliminated. Hopefully that will take care of that one. Just reduce these. That will be great. Need these units over here to come at this at the flank. It probably would have been best if I used raiders for this. We have another one just there, ready to go. They are murdering our troops. We need to start moving forwards into that, but we need some of this weakened before we do. If we can weaken that, move our way forwards, hopefully we can get in that section. Oh yeah, I thought about going this way first, didn't I? I did, we could occupy this forest to some degree. We have new orders. And then come out this flank. That is what we were going to do. Attention. So that is good. You can come over here and just take care of that now. In fact, no, you go home. Get these fresh troops in. Get these into cover for them just in case they decide that they've had enough. We can have a couple of units hopefully stashed in there. Which will hopefully hold that area. Now, they're all going to get murdered. You're tired. We'll just keep two units in there for the time being. You, I've forgotten about you. You're just going to have to go home at this point. We can get more units up here. Now, this is going to be challenging. We need to come in from the side angle. Equipe. Take care of these MGs. Get rid of that. Excellent. I want them to reinforce from this section. That is what we want. We can bombard it. Like that. 
We'll we'll see if one unit up there will do a good bit of difference or not. Start moving some of these around. We'll send them home at this point. We'll have three there for the time being while we resupply all of this area with additional Frenchmen. Right there. Let's just see what's up there, because technically they won't be able to do anything if I keep men in this forest over here. That is a very nice. I'm going to keep three in that forest. That means I'm going to have to use some of these. I might even use these for it. The British will be better at it with their increased range and vision. Murder some more of these. And some more of these. That MG is gone. They do still have a couple more, however. We can get rid of this one. With all the cannons that we have available. Just wait for t waiting now for these troops to arrive. Oh. We still have artillery somewhere. There it is. We're not going to be able to get that. We could suppress it, technically. See about doing that. Anything now that comes from over here is just going to get murdered. Hopefully, they don't run out. We have to play cat and mouse. I'm not going to have the elites there because they're just going to get murdered all the time. I should see about getting these British lads in there. Right, we've got plenty of units in here now. We can start moving them all into here straight away in. All of them. Attention! Get moving. That's it. Get moving, lads. On a de nouveaux ordres. On y va. Then we can just run across. We can do with some more bombardment. That MG is not dead. Use these heavies to weaken anything in this area. That's the MG down. Probably going to be another one over here, but that doesn't really matter. We have new orders. You need to go. Yeah, you do need to go. You need to get going yesterday. I'm going to actually move some of these back down here and move these across. Our troops are getting hit by this artillery. It's not very nice of them. I could artillery that artillery. However, it doesn't do that much against it. Hope I'm just not wasting too much time doing all of this manoeuvring. My only concern. Get these in as well. These have be armed. Murder some of them again. If we weaken this area significantly enough. Attention! That, art that artillery is being a right nuisance. If I run in there, I don't think I'll be able to take it. Got all this there. We're going to go for it in a moment. Get these facing the correct way and all will be well. These are all knackered. I'm just going to send these home. That was a bit of a mistake. Shouldn't have bothered. I do feel like I'm wasting quite a bit of time now. But we're going to go for it now. Let's wait for a moment for the guns to reload. I don't want to murder them because they might replenish from this direction. So here we go. Pause the game. To suppress them. Lap some of these. Wait for it. There it is. Hit these at the back. 
tirer avec toute l'artillerie. Un tir de barrage sur cette position. On a nos cibles. Préparez-vous, soldats. They shouldn't be able to shoot unless we're right on top of them. Tir de barrage ordonné. Suppress here as well, because we're going to come at that area. We're going to suppress here as well, actually. So here we go. We're going to send those in there. Attention. Attention. Ready on the line. On a de nouveaux ordres. I'll go for this area as well. Now this is going to be very dangerous. Wouldn't recommend it. Préparez-vous sur la ligne. Tenez-vous prêt. Sur la ligne. As many people tend to die. Artillery is all now being lunged forwards. Our men are going to get blown to bits. Not ideal. We're going to send more artillery. They must have some more in here. If we can contest this, we'll be all right. We're just going to have to try our best to get them in as best we can. You need to go home. You could go with in that trench if you can get there. Not quick, they're going to get smashed as well. Right, well that didn't really work, did it? I think I've kind of fluked this, not going to lie. They can't reinforce from this section though now, so that is the whole point of it. We could even come in at a frontal attack here. Get some of the elites in just here, right quick. Come in from the front. Quickly, lads. We can have all of this run into that forest. And now we can also now have all of this. We have new orders. We have new orders. Run straight up here into this. They can now regen from this area, so we need to make sure. Spread out. The brass wants this piece of ground. They're going to come in and we can suppress this area just here. We need to contest it. That's the problem. This might be a bit risky. Suppress and suppress. You murder that. You get in that bit. You get in that bit. This may not work. Our big guns are now coming. Hit them at the back. We may be in. They have units in here. That is not expected. We are in here now, however. This is going a bit better than what I thought it would. Now if I could just select... That man we, we will be a lot better off. They're stuck in the open. Suppress some of that right quick. You just need to go home. They cannot reinforce from this section. We have taken care of these units here. And now they can only reinforce from here. Meaning we can attack them quite merrily, hopefully. You're being hurt badly. We have new orders. keep hitting these and drain them of anything that they have left. You just need to go home. Kind of muckled that bit up. Now we can get more Frenchmen in. We can send them in this area. We've only got five minutes and we can send them over here as well. And up here. They're going to keep trying to grab this point. And that also locks plenty of them there as well. So once these units arrive, all of these are now thoroughly coming. Look at all that. Well and truly on the way. We can start clearing some of this, make it easier for our lads. This is working how I actually wanted it to. This could cause them to have a mass rout or at least surrender. 
while I try and retake this. Need these, there we go. Start bombarding some of this a little bit more. Get rid of these. Don't even use all our artillery that is available on this. We are smashing them thoroughly in the forest. Quick lads, murder them all. They are actually open to attack. I don't know which set of soldiers that is, but they are going to get hurt. All of that has been taken. Excellent. Right, now we need to start thinking about seriously taking this. While artillery is currently weakened, they are currently also a little bit bugged. Not ideal. Attention! Dispersez-vous! Allez, on accélère! Attention! We just move back slightly, it might fix itself. But that is a lot. We could even artillery them, to be fair. I mean, that would be fantastic. Lots of MGs here, that isn't good. Start hurting some of this. We can black some of that. Suppress it as well. Just about. Hopefully it will reach. And it does. We lost control of that area. They are still hitting these. Start running into this bit of trench now. Hopefully we can murder all of them. They're not going to like that. Move forward, chat. They're all kind of locked there. Suppress that machine gun. Plenty of them in these trenches. That wasn't what I was hoping for. We're going to have to do something now. We need to take out this trench. What are you doing? Stop. Get some artillery in there. Not too sure what is going on with that area. Get more elite Frenchmen in. And get more down here as well, ideally. We need to stop the timer, so we're going to have to take this with force. We can suppress. That and that. Let's send them over to the top real quick. Get you running down there and take care of that trench. You can assist. That will stop the timer. I'm hoping to stop the enemy from... I want them to surrender. I don't think they're going to do that. You go in there right quick. Oh, we just need to stop the timer. Come on, lads. You lot stop that. We need more troops down this way. That will take longer to get troops in, so we've got all of this now available. They're all just bungled up in that, which isn't great. Not too sure exactly what is going on. We can get some more artillery involved. Are they going to shoot them? I don't think they are. They don't really want to. We have taken this little bit of trench. That needs to be taken care of. You need to go over there. You're being hurt by a machine gun. So we're not going to have enough time. Now they're replanning from this area. If that hadn't have bugged, I think we'd have been alright. But they are not going to be giving that away to us, are they? On a de nouveaux ordres. En marche. Need more troops in. We can go for the basic French now. Get more of them in. 
don't have enough time to take control of this point. No, we've not done it on this occasion. I don't know what's going on around here. It's uh, clearly not perfect yet. But we didn't get what we wanted. That is quite infuriating. Maybe I should have stuck with the original plan and just took the command center. All of this is a little bit of a mess though. I'd like to know how many people died in this forest. Let me know your comments in that. I didn't feel as coordinated in that at all. Yeah, the casualties reflect on that as well. Not good. Well, you live and learn. Hmm. To say that was the same map and very similar layout, different approach really does show that that approach wasn't as good as the first. I probably should have kept with it. It still counts as a victory, but I wanted to take the star off. Ran out of time. Time is the issue because it takes so long to push the enemy back because they're all supermen. They also now have two more cores available, which is fantastic for me. Need to readjust. If you have, thank you very much for watching all the way through. I'll leave that with you. Let me know your thoughts on that. And I'll see you in the next video. Cheers. Bye-bye.